An arrest at a school bus stop in Bridgeville. Police tackled a man after they say he commit, committed a sexual act while staring at a group of students. Megan Schiller is live outside the Allegheny County Jail with what the judge just ordered. Megan. I want to warn you that the details of this case are very disturbing, but the only way the guy is getting out of jail anytime soon is if he comes up with $10,000 worth of cash. The judge also ordered that he is not allowed to go anywhere near a Charters Valley bus stop because of what allegedly happened earlier this morning. Bridgeville's chief of police showed us the exact scene of the crime. I could tell he was so intently focused on the students. I just made a bull rush and he never saw or heard me coming. Chief Chad King hid in the bushes, waiting for Anthony Cardamone to appear. Then he caught him in the act, allegedly masturbating while staring at young students standing just a short distance away. Two of the students were under um, the age of 16, I believe 14 and 15, which enhances the grading of the crime for indecent exposure. So up here beyond this retaining wall, mm -hmm. kind of in this parking lot. Yes, where the kids were. yes, right right over here, just several feet. And they came from behind the building along this alleyway. One of the older students noticed Cardamone Wednesday morning and told his parents. They called police and Chief King decided to sit and wait. He works in the area as a landscaper. He catches a, a Port Authority bus and He's been coming to our area since March of this year. Neighbor Linda Beto said she's glad police acted fast. It's uncalled for. Um, I don't have small children, but I am concerned for the people that do. You know, like, I just can't imagine it happening in a community like this. I talked to the Chartiers Valley School District, and they tell me that they are very proud of the students for speaking up and acting quickly. They also do want parents to know that counselors will be on hand for any of the students who are disturbed by this man's alleged actions and this morning's arrest. Reporting live at the Allegheny County Jail, I'm Megan Schiller, KDK News.